Alright everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's been a couple days, I think, um, but the question that you will see on the thumbnail of this video is, do sports need to be returning right now? Does, is the sports world ready for, you know, no fans having to test for the coronavirus and stuff like that? And you know, if there are fans, you know, again, you know, you gotta test for Corona, you know, COVID-19. Um, personally, I don't think any sport should be really be playing right now. Um, NASCAR is all right, because, I mean, nobody cares about NASCAR. Let's just be real. Um, all the big sports, we'll talk all the big boys, stuff like that. And, of course, some women's leagues as well, which are, you know, big in the United States, at least to you know, big enough to where they're being covered in major, you know, outlets and stuff like that. But, you know, like tennis, it, there's no, like, there's nothing with tennis right now. Of course, NFL doesn't start until September the 10th. And I believe, I don't think I've talked about it yet, but there has been some pushbacks and stuff like that with college football and stuff like that. Uh, you know, like games are getting canceled, getting pushed back. It's a, it's mostly the lower leagues and stuff right now, but there has been some stuff with the with the big old you know the bowl subdivision, the big bowl is Division One A. You know where they had to move the game with Navy and Notre Dame that was supposed to be in Ireland. They had to move that back to Labor Day, but um, yeah. So MLB finally got it sat together. Major League Baseball got their act together. They will be opening up training camps on July 1st. Now, players and stuff have been getting tested, and they've been getting that positive result for COVID-19. So, um, I don't know how in the world they're going to play 60 games, but it, it I, I guess it's going to happen. We'll just have to see um, what the world's going on. NBA is supposed to return, of course, with 22 teams. Like I did in a video a few weeks back, I believe, with, you know, 22 teams. I mean, basically putting in, you know, putting in numbers for seeding at this point. It's basically all about getting the seeds right. And there's all sorts of stuff. There's all sorts of drama going on. You know, Kyrie Irving and other players have been speaking out due to all the stuff that's been going on. Um, but who knows what's going to happen. Um, it should be... You know, down in Florida, where it's also pretty chaotic. Um, again, NFL might just be going on as normal, unless you know something happens. But we still have a long way to go until September the tenth. So, um, the NHL hockey twenty fourteen playoff. It's a little bit too large, I believe, uh, for hockey uh, for a twenty fourteen playoff to be taking place probably would just say 20 you know I'm not a hockey fan but I do know that you know that training camps are going to open on July the 10th so who knows how long um, and there's supposed to be two sites that are supposed to be announced I don't think there's going to be fans for the NHL at all um, of course you know as far as soccer goes National Women's Soccer League is returning uh, also, again, the WBA is supposed to be returning at some point um, with like a 22-game season. Um, I assume there will also be no fans, considering the NBA isn't really thinking about having fans. Um, but other places as well, there was a league over in New Zealand, I believe. I think it was like a soccer or rugby league in New Zealand that has basically restarted. They got fans were packed. And, and that's just because they followed COVID-19 guidelines and stuff like that. They, and the country was small too, so you know, there, there's no way that too many people are going to get it. Here in the U.S., however, you know, I look outside and I see people with no mask. I, uh, I go outside, you know, every other day, you know, to just get some groceries and something like that. And I still see people with no mask out here in Texas, so... I don't think anything's going to be opening up here anytime soon. 
or at least they should be anyway but other countries as well you know they got soccer back and they're getting ready to keep on going um, and again NASCAR NASCAR has been doing their thing for a while you know but um, and of course there's some controversies involving NASCAR as well you know due to all the political social movements going on right now um, but um, golf golf looks like it's going to be okay um, there's either few or no fans at all you know coming to these golf tournaments stuff like that um, and horse racing it'll be fine I don't think there's going to be fans for it I mean most people are just going to bet anyways I mean who even watches horse racing? Um, and I think I said it already, but tennis, I don't know what's happening with tennis right now. There's nothing until August with the whole tennis thing. They had to move, you know, stuff around. You know, they had to move, like, what, Wimbledon around? Um, no, well, wait, they had, yeah, they, had to move, they, had to move, they had to move their big events around, you know, the U.S. Open and stuff like that. They had to move all their big stuff around their big major um, events and stuff around I do believe the US Open was moved to like November or something either that or Wimbledon um, but yeah uh, but honestly my personal opinion I don't think the United States is really ready to even be open right now um, you know people still out here without no mask on there's still states you know getting higher and higher amounts of cases each and every day um, and main point is is to let me put this on here is to please when you go outside you put on this mask here you put this mask on you know you get some hand sanitizer and you know you know just get that hand sanitizer keep your hands clean and stuff like that uh, I don't know how many times I don't know what kind of common sense common sense will tell you to put a mask on you see that there's stuff going on you see that people are get, are getting sick and stuff like that but no nobody's listening like I got about got about five or six of these masks in this little bag here and ain't nobody and ain't nobody else using a mask just a shame so yeah that'll pretty much do it here um, be sure to like share subscribe do all that good stuff and we'll see you again in the next video peace